history of the UFC, been a pro since 2003. Three, eight next week, still going strong, and when you have a mustache like that, you're going to get fans on your side as well. DC has been fighting for a really long time. But you guys got to understand, Eddie Wineland became a pro in 2003. Very few guys are still fighting from that era. The damage accumulated over the course of a career has become an issue for Eddie Wineland. Hopefully this helps him be a little bit more durable. Like you said, since 2003, this man's been doing this, and I, he was the first person to introduce me to my opponent in 2007, Uriah Faber. He wow. knew Uriah Faber. He said, hey, I want you to meet your opponent. We looked at each other and hated each other at the beginning, <laughs> and Wineland was the one who introduced us. I've known this man a long time. He's got nasty straight punches. He keeps his hands down at the hips, so what happens is it's hard to read. Is, is, is it going to be an uppercut? Is he going to be an overhand right? Is he going to be a straight right? Is he going to be a jab? Is he going to be a left uppercut? It makes his punches hard to read, and that's the Bantamweight division. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner. A freestyle fighter sitting five feet six inches tall, weighing it officially 135 and one half pounds. His record stands at 19 victories, five defeats, and one draw. Fighting out of Sparta, Michigan, here is Cody, the Spartan Steamer. Five feet seven and a half inches tall, he weighed in 135 pounds. This 40 fight veteran holds a professional record of 24 victories, 15 defeats, and one draw. Fighting out of Chesterton, Indiana, here is the former WAC Bantamweight champion of the world, Eddie Weinberg! And your referee in charge of the action, Jacob Montalvo. Jacob Montalvo, third man in. The lovely Brooklyn Wren is with us. In the home of the Texas Longhorns. As is Ariani and Brittany. Ready, Cody? Ready, Eddie? Biggest Fight. favorite of the night is that man, Cody Stamen, who's in the white. Eddie Wineland, can't miss him. Very unique stance, ink, and mustache. He's in the black. 